Hello, today we are going to insert custom knee boards in our mission. Let's get started with covering the requirements for DCS knee boards. First, knee boards need to be close to a 4x6 aspect ratio and either in PNG or JPEG format. I personally make mine at a resolution of 1440x2160 and save them as JPEGs. I normally use Adobe InDesign to do the bulk of the work for the text and tables. Then I take them into Photoshop where I can add some images and effects if needed. Okay, I've already created a very simple knee board for the convoy strike mission that we have been working on. To get this to show up when flying the mission, we have to do a little bit of work within the mission file. Open it with an archiving program, such as 7-zip or WinRAR. Be sure not to extract the mission file or it will break the mission. Once open, add the folder kneeboard, ensuring it is in all caps. Open the kneeboard folder and create another folder named images, again in all caps. This is where your general kneeboards will go. If you wish to have aircraft specific kneeboards for the mission, you can do this as well. Within the kneeboard folder, create folders of the name of the aircraft you want to have custom kneeboards. The name of the folder will have to be the correct format or DCS will not recognize it. On the DCS user files, Bailey has provided a file you can download that has all the folder names to be used for kneeboards along with a PDF with some more information in it. Referencing this, we know that the folder name for the F-18 is FA-18C underscore Hornet. For testing purposes, I'm going to just put an image in the F-18 folder for now to show how it works. And then I'll put the mission kneeboard in the images folder so that any aircraft in the mission can see it. Once you have your images where they belong, close your archive program. Now let's load up the mission and check our kneeboards. For testing purposes, I have also added an A10 so that we can test that the F-18 kneeboard is only being shown in the F-18. Let's jump in our F-18 and look at the kneeboards. Here you can see the mission kneeboard, and here is the F-18 specific kneeboard. Let's jump in our A-10 real quick and make sure that we can't see the F-18 kneeboard. And here's our mission kneeboard. And as you can see, the F-18 specific kneeboard is not showing up in the A-10. And that's it. That's how you can add custom kneeboards to your custom missions. This was a short one. I hope it can help you in creating more in-depth missions. Hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Next up, we'll be getting more in-depth with scripting so that we can have a more dynamic mission.